It's not going in. <gasps> yes! Oh my god, it's going in! It's actually doing it! Oh my god! Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of FTB Pyramid! Hope you're all doing good today. I am doing fantastic. I'm really, really, really enjoying this mob pack. But I want to say thank you for the love and support that you've been showing everyone. It has been absolutely amazing. I couldn't ask for better responses in the whole wide world. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but anyway, everyone, I've been keeping these going. We're still getting our trowel of grass going along. I haven't been on for a couple of days. So, um, yeah, I didn't AFK like I was supposed to, unfortunately. But never mind. So what I wanted to do is, I'm still waiting for all of that to go. Um, I'm not going to take that down until it says uh, 100%. But anyway, what I want to do, everyone, is... I've been having a look at some recipes and I need to get some things going. Uh, for example, I need to get some RF actually like stored at least. Um, so I wanna make one of the uh, energy cells, which is relatively easy. We can make that. Uh, but one thing, yeah, as you can see, I've been looking at this. One thing I wanna do is this induction furnace. Now the induction furnace actually needs, um, it's this thing, it needs rubber for these insulated copper cables. Uh, we need copper as well. So there's a lot of stuff that we need um, for this, but we do need plastic, which we need dry rubber, which is from loads of tiny dry rubber, which you get from the latex processing unit. Um, all I know so far is that I need to make this thing, which I'm going to do, hopefully, I have enough of the resources. But yeah, so we can get that and then we can get our glowstone, our, oh God, I can't remember what that thing's called, and then our normal quartz uh, for this thing here. But like I said, firstly, I actually want to get the energy cell produced um, so that I haven't got to keep filling up these furnaces. But I'm not entirely sure how I connect this to RF, whether I just put an energy cell below it um but anyway so let's quickly go ahead and make this one i can put that next to our redstone furnace then and all we need is the coal so we need lead redstone ooh high electrum um you're you're not what i was expecting to have there to be honest you are silver and gold okay we don't have silver no Ooh, i don't think we have silver that's tin. I don't think we have silver. Are we supposed to get silver from somewhere? That'd suck. Oh, that looks like that silver, does it? Is that silver? How can I tell? EU? What is that? Um. That, oh, I can't look at it. How am I supposed to know what that is then? Like, oh my God. That, um, that's a little bit annoying. Unless I can make silver somehow, which I don't think I can. Oh, no, hang on. That was silver? Did we make this thing? Did we make the shock absorber? Shock absorber. No, we haven't made this. Damn it, I'm gonna have to make this. And that's silver, I think, for the gold. Oh, dearing me, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we need to go into actually additions and start making some of this stuff. Black crystal shard. Hang on. How do I get this thing? Coal. But I don't have coal either, which means I need biomass. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Talk about throwing me off! That sucks! All right, well, I need to collect the biomass then. Which we did actually do last episode, but we didn't really get a collection of the stuff going. Um, okay, well, is there some kind of tank? Uh, tank? There's a singularity tank. I don't know if that can... Ooh, a rain tank? Um, industrial craft. Portable tank? How do we make you? Probably make this thing. How much does it hold? 20,000, 20,000, and I was pretty sure, wasn't that like 100,000 we need for the biomass? 
Hi, no, you're not the right thing. No, crafting grid. Might be able to make that. Biomass. Okay, yeah. What is that, 500,000? I'm, I'm so bad at the numbers. <laughs> I'm not stupid, I swear. What about this crafting grid? Can we make this crafting grid as well today? Crafting grid. Crafting grid. This. Oh my God. Is that refined storage? Um, no. Oh my God, Gordons. Okay, biomass it is first and foremost then. Uh, but what I do want to do as well is sort out some of our storage today. Uh, get some drawers going. Um, yeah, these drawers and try and sort this area out a little bit. Obviously, it'll be a lot better when this grass ain't going all the way across. So what I've just looked into on this thing is if I go on biomass and click R for recipe, when I did the um, fermenter, yeah, can I just stick water in there? <laughs> because that would suck. I made all of that fruit juice for nothing. Hang on. Is that actually a thing? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Let's put you in. It is a thing? Oh my God, can you actually believe that? All right, so we need, we need some more mulch anyway. Was this what we got from the, what is this? Decaying wheat. I can put decaying wheat in a moistener. Molding wheat, oh my God. Okay, so we could make that because I don't have enough apples to get the mulch, unfortunately. I do have the, the squeezer. And the carrots. Um, but yeah, I, I don't have a carrot. And I really would like a carrot, but I just don't have one. So we might have to go along this decaying wheat and use the moistener. But how do we make the moistener? Oh, God. More bronze, copper. Okay, we may have to go down that route. But for now, I'm just going to fill this up for water until that mulch does its job. And yeah, then I can start transferring it. Um, but I think it was on the side that I have to input it, which means I will need a fluid, a fluid, um, cable, fluid, fluid cable, fluid cable, okay, fluid duct, just the normal one, this one, is that the normal one, okay, and that's, that's copper, all right, that's not too terrible, all right, well, let's have a go at making this portable tank, um, it, yeah, it holds 20,000. Okay, so we need to make this. We only want one of those. Then we should be able to make that straight away. Okay, so the portable tank we now have. Let's also make the the fluid duct as well. This one. Uh, I need glass. <laughs> I just literally stopped cooking up glass. Okay, let's put um, glass in there and do that. Can we just stick this on top though? And then, where's the um, 8,000, get your energy drink, tank full. Yes, I know it's full. Do I need a wrench to use you? I have no idea. The, the, I know it's the Yeti wrench or whatever it's called. Okay, so let's get the fluid duct. I might as well make two of that, 12 of those, two of those, what am I talking about? Okay, so can I just do that? Nope, and that. I need the Yeti wrench, don't I? Hang on, Yeti wrench, or is that, hmm, wrench? Um, it's not, it's not that one. I need the thermal, ex it, there should be a thermal expansion one, right? No? Maybe it's the RF tools one then. This one? I need lapis and, okay, we can do that. Oh, running low on lapis though. Like, hopefully this is the right one for using the lapis. <laughs> oh, what does it say? Click on air to change mode. Use as a normal wrench, okay. So, ah, oh no, what is, what is suck and all of that? <laughs> I'm so bad at this. Okay, let's grab you off then. Oh my God. That progress is absolutely amazing. I'm so glad I decided to stick that on there. Thank you. <laughs> no! Do not lose them! Give me back! Okay, let's try again. Let's try putting the portable tank um, 
here. Doesn't look like it's going to suck it out though, does it? Oh, how do I get this? I'm trying to fly and I can't fly. Hup, hup. Okay. Now you go out. <gasps> no, hang on. Is the only way I can get this out in a stupid little canister? That would suck. All right, so I finally worked it out. I need a servo on this thing. I completely forgot how to use these stupid cables, but that seems to be working okay. All of the biomass is now out. We are out of the mulch now though. I don't know how, how much. Yeah, uh, unless, oh no, this red bar I'm assuming has to go down first and then it'll stop working. But then we're probably gonna have to make that dehydrator to actually, um, yeah. Yeah, that sucks. I'll keep an eye on that though, I'll keep an eye on that. And then we're gonna transfer that over to our beautiful little thing that we have over there to get our 50,000. But yeah, the, the uh, RF is a bit of an issue at the moment. We'll get there, we'll get there. All right, so whilst I'm waiting for that to do its business and um, fill up for me, <laughs> I wanna continue to extend out our platform and then get some structure to our little base area. Of course, this is where we're gonna have our animal farm. Um, so I want to bring it out one past that there of all the stone. We should have enough stone now, hopefully. <laughs> And then we have a nice wide platform, which should be more than big enough for all of our stuff that we need. So I'm going to build this across. Hopefully this will be done by that time. Uh, it's out of saplings, so no, it won't be doing anything. Luckily, we have 10 tons of saplings. <laughs> okay, you go in there. Then, yeah, I'm assuming when this is done, then we are done. But yeah, okay. I'm gonna build. I'm gonna build some stone platform first, though. That is on the agenda first and foremost. All right. So the platform is now built. Let's see how our little machine is doing. It stopped. Is this now full? Then okay. If this is full, let's grab. Oh God, grab that. <laughs> Go around here. And let's see if we can input some of this in. I think it was in the side here. Okay, forestry biomass. What is this thing then? Black hole tank. Okay, so if I just stick uh, this on and put it in like that. I need the servo back though, don't I? I need that servo, otherwise it's not gonna do anything because of this stupid. <laughs> <laughs> fluid ducts. That's where Ender IO is good, I suppose. But th this wasn't too expensive. I can't moan too much. Right. So now I'm hoping that it hasn't got to be one whole stream of biomass going in. I'm hoping that it should be good enough the way it is. Right. Put you on. Ignored. Now it's pumping it out. It's not going in. Oh, yes! Oh my God, it's going in! It's actually doing it! Oh my God! <laughs> yes! Okay, biomass then. We should be able to get relatively easy, apart from the fact that I think we need more of the mulch, um, which we get from ML mulch uh, from the moistener. We might have to use the moistener because the squeezer we can only use with the carrot and the apple. So yeah, I'm gonna have to make this moistener then, and then we can make some of this wheat. I'm not entirely sure why, if if this is like an output. Um, I don't know, don't know what this is, but then I'm hoping that once we get then our decaying wheat, then yeah, that gives us the mulch. Okay, moistener it is, but look at that. Are you nearly empty? Is that all we had? All right, fair enough. Well, we're, what, like a fifth? No, third of the way-ish. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Let's go and put you back then, mister. All right, so I've now filled up a tank so that I can automate this a little bit. Um, let's ignore that. Actually, does that have to go in this? Missing liquid. Okay, so I think that might have to go on the other side on here. 
and then yeah okay right i still need to get used to that right so we have our squeezer this is where i'm going to start making a tiny bit of mess and i've got to apologize now uh, we also have the moistener and then i have i don't have i thought i'd made it i didn't make it i'm gonna make the um the leadstone energy thing lead the the duct leadstone flux duct gonna make one of those we need six redstone five six let's quickly make you okay and then i have a servo for this i don't know if i need one to go into the machines this one not dark enough a lower light level is required what does this not need rf no power required okay oh okay it's not dark enough that is so weird okay well this doesn't matter then i was gonna connect that with that but as i don't need to then you know we'll just leave that like that but it's not dark enough though <laughs> like do i need to build it into a little box just that seems so weird to me do i do that no recipe missing resources okay so that works that is so weird no recipe no matching recipe is found okay so we need to put i think that went there oh wheat oh wheat that's a recipe go again then it needs water okay oh my god this is so confusing <laughs> i'm yolo in this so much right now okay let's put water in how do I get rid of that? Is this the recipe? All right, before I annoy anyone, I'm going to Google this. All right, so I've got it working. I forgot that we had to do the whole cobblestone thing here, didn't we? So we now have our moldy wheat being produced. Let's just fill this up. I know I could use the thing, but I just can't be bothered. <laughs> Go? No. All right. Go back in there. All right. So that is now making our moldy wheat. Then we have to put it, go it, have it going back through. Um, let's make some more wheat though. Let's make wheat. Let's just make 10 ton of wheat because we can, because I have 10 ton of bones. Okay. That should do for now for the mulch. And then we should be good for all of our biomass production. You go there. No, there. Okay, it's gonna go, damn it. <laughs> All right, well, that's not good, is it? What What do we get from that? Is this a mulch? Okay, this is the decaying wheat. All right, well, we'll work with this. We'll leave this to do its job for a little while. Um, I don't know what the cobblestone are turning into. Maybe mossy cobble. Oh, but it says here, look, 19, 10, 2, and then we have none of the mulch yet. Okay, we are getting there. Our biomass is now full again um it's doing relatively good so let's take this please don't go over the side where did you go you're in my inventory let's go and connect this back over here <laughs> oh man this is actually too exciting this is a very 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 good pack for feeling like you've accomplished something it's really really good i haven't actually found a pack that actually gives you gives me at least as much reward as this is i i really really like it really like it Okay, so let's put our servo in again. Ignore that. Get rid of that. And now that's going in. Yes. Is it going in? No, it's not yet. Register. Yes. <laughs> Let it at least be halfway. It's going to be halfway. Go on. There we go. It's over halfway. Amazing stuff. And in that time, we have one mulch as well. Look at us go. So let's dump that in there. And then that should continue to give us if we had more power <laughs> oh we're getting there we are actually getting there let's just dump that in and then that should be enough for our the rest of our biomass then which is absolutely amazing all right so what i'm going to start to do now everyone is just make a little area for um for our little forestry section because i found something that i am actually going to use the biomass for um it's actually a biomass generator it generates eu from biomass and eu is something that we need over there at some point so i was thinking well you know let's let's just start making that at least as we've got a production of biomass but i just want to move it all 
and make it relatively clean looking. I know it's all built out of stone, but you know, it's the block that I most readily have and I can at least make it look neat, can't I? Rather than anything else. Okay, so just for now, we need to put down, did I leave the red, I don't, I'm like, where is the redstone furnace? It's here. Okay, so we need to put this redstone furnace down just for now, otherwise we're not gonna have any energy. Um, we want to have our portable tank probably in the corner, if we plonk it there. Then we wanna have our, uh, it's the fermenter, right? If we put the fermenter down there, yeah, it's the fermenter, then that can have access to both of those. Then we wanna have our squeezer. Does that, did that need water? That didn't need anything. Okay, that is fair enough. Let's put our portable tank here. I also need to find a way to get water, um, like a just a normal or interactive. Ah, this, we can interact with it, right? Oh my God, what is this thing called? I've, and there's watering cans, of course there is. Can I make? Oh my God, that's a thing. Oh my God, I could have grown that ages ago. All right, fair enough. Anyway, what was I doing? I want to have, what is it called? What is this mod? Extra utilities um, at extra utilities. I want the th this thing, transfer node. And then I can get an infinite amount of water. Okay, right, so let's actually move this over then and let's get our infinite amount of water set up because that is going to be the best thing for us. If we put it in the corner, if we make it look half pretty, <laughs> there we go. We'll get our buckets of water from over here. I've got too much stuff on me though. Let's just dump that in there. Okay, and then what we'll, what we'll be able to do is just transfer the water directly to that thing. Okay, so how do we make the transfer node? <laughs> That's gonna be the next thing, but let's put this portable tank, uh, we'll have to set it up this side now then, like that, and then we'll have the other ones separate, probably. That'll do like that for now. We'll probably need to get another furnace generator for now as well. These machines though, they're just all the same, aren't they? <laughs> All right, well, let's make this transfer node then. Let's just get that going, we need we need glass, we need stone slabs, we need redstone, and we need a bucket, a bucket and stone. Okay, so our stone, <laughs> I just run all the way around, did not need to do that. Let's get ourselves some of the half slabs. I can't remember how many we actually needed. Um, the glass, I already had some. So let's do transfer nodes, fluids, 64 of those, and then two more redstone two more redstone. Let's get you going, gone. Okay, so we have four of these now. Um, how do I actually go about doing this again? Can I do that and then that and then remove that again? Yeah, okay, I can. Then in here, I needed an upgrade. I remember that much. Which one was it? Upgrade mining, this one. So I need this, which means I need a resonator. <laughs> Oh no! Where am I supposed to get the resonating redstone crystal? <gasps> An ender pearl. Oh no! I don't think I've even seen an enderman yet. Can we get an ender pearl from anywhere? That sucks a little bit. Can we make ender pearls? <laughs> Please let there be a way of making ender pearls. If not, I'm a little bit stuffed. Hi, no, nothing. Oh my God. I don't like the fact that these have no rewards. Surely that should be a thing. Oh, what are we gonna do then? Am I gonna have to do this manually? That sucks. What do we get from the biomass again? Nothing of use. Okay, ender pearls then. So we need this. Um, ender pearls. Carpenter? What are these? Pulsating mesh? Mysterious comb? How do we get that? Go back, go back, go. Oh, stupid thing. <laughs> oh no, now I'm losing the plot. All right, well, that's got to be something that I look into getting then, an ender pearl at some point. 
Elven trade? No. Ender lily. I don't even have an ender lily. Resonant. Yeah. Okay. All right. So for now then, I'm going to have to do this manually until I see an enderman at some point. Um... So we could try actually extending this up one and hoping for an enderman and then making it safe so that if an enderman actually spawns, we don't die. Um, <laughs> so if we, yeah, if we do that, that's the only way I can kind of think about getting an enderman. But he is going to teleport as soon as we hit him, which is going to suck a little bit. Um, but yeah, like I said, that's probably the best bet for now um, to do. <laughs> this is always scary though. They're just going to fly out. Um, let's do this one at a time. I am going to do it like this, everyone. I'm too scared to do it any other way. All right, so I feel like we're pretty much ready now to take this over and finish off our quest. This is now full. This should technically be enough. At least I'm hoping <laughs> that it's going to be enough. Then we have one more thing actually done. Even though the only thing... Well, I think that's nickel, which we needed for something. I can't remember what it was now. But I'm hoping that the coal I can actually put on our little resource generator to grab coal. Because I needed that for something as well. For the life of me, I can't remember what it was, though. Um, so, yeah, let's wait and see. It's at 46. That should do it, right? Oh, my God. Look at it. <laughs> Oh, let's wait until it goes green, everyone. We've got to do it. There it is! Oh, my God, the outside turned green. I'll stop taking it. No, I don't want you to, to keep taking it. I need that for energy, you know. Oh, man, we've given it far too much. <laughs> let's take all of our stuff back. Nice. Okay, let's get our reward. Please be in here. Yes! Okay, we have nickel, sugar cane, and coal. That is incredible. The next thing that we wanted to do, was it this shock absorber that we needed the stuff for? Shock absorber. Uh, this we needed... Uh, oh no, that you can use charcoal. But this is like an empower thing. Void crystal block. I still don't quite understand. Oh, there we go. This is what we needed. So we needed the atomic reconstructor to get this. I don't know what 60 CF means though. But we can look in our little book, it says. Add two additions, the atomic reconstructor is used to craft. Okay. So we just put it in there. I'm pretty sure that's the one that shoots stuff out and turns it into coal. But let's go and see if it actually works on this thing. I'm hoping that it does. Then I can stop actually chopping down trees all the time. Because <laughs> that's what my life consists of at the moment. Right, let's do that. Let's put you there. And let's have our fingers crossed that that does work. We have sugar cane now though, so we can plant that down. Let's put him, I just realized this has no water around it. Let's put him there, no? Hang on, sugar, oh, does it need to be directly beside? Um, do that. Oh my God, brain. <laughs> Figure it out, love that that would not work. Oh my God. As soon did it i'm thinking that's not gonna work is it oh my days right let's put you there <laughs> oh my god what's the other thing we got nickel okay so let's take that off put you in there and let's get the nickel on here all right we are doing it it looks like it's working its way around this way so we're not going to find out until it's done the copper at least <laughs> all right so for this eu energy input we need Oh my God. Is that three million? Oh my God, that is three million. <laughs> All right, fair enough. So let's see how this machine works. That is a lot of EU, wow. Um, all right, let's just put him down uh, here for now. All right, so I'm assuming, well, we need to get it out of this tank first, don't we? So we might need to have another... How's that going to work? Hmm. Maybe it goes into another tank and then inputs into this. All right, so I Googled the tank and you can just take it from any of the sides, which I didn't realize. Okay, so we have some being generated. It doesn't tell you how much though. Um, and I don't really know how to store 
this energy, whether I can still store it in the um, the cell. Um, what does it say? It hold, start, red stone, so that's RF. So how do we store EU then? Um, I wouldn't know how we're going to transfer it over there, to be honest. All right, so I've just Googled it. Apparently, I need to have the charge pad. This stores... I don't see the difference between these, to be honest. Oh, it might be this, actually. This thing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, well... <laughs> Wait, oh god, I just knocked the thing on my mic. Ignore that. So at least at least we're making some bioenergy, but then that did come that did make me remember. Sorry, the words will come out today. That we needed to make the plastic, didn't we? As well. The RF. How much RF do we need? That's three million as well. Okay, fair enough. Uh we needed to make the induction furnace the plastic, wasn't it? That's what we actually started to do induction furnace we wanted to make the plastic so i need to make the latex processing unit and then i have a feeling it has something to do with those rubber trees that we have over there but i'm not sure um let's have a go at actually um getting our rubber tree where is it it's here somewhere i only have two two chests at the moment did i miss it where is it oh no it's missing or is it here oh no it's here oh god panic just set in then okay so let's dump that down i have no bones though didn't realize i was out of bones until i went to grow a tree and thought oh hang on no bones and there's nothing oh all right well i'll, I'll wait for things to spawn then everyone there's an enderman in my farm there is an enderman in my farm oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god okay where is he hang on Oh, he's over there. Hop, hop. Is he just going to stay there because he can't see me? Oh, God. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. I need your pearl. Did... D pearl? No! There wasn't a pearl! That sucks! Oh, my God! I was just literally building my wall and I was like, hang on. That looks to be some cute purple fuzz coming from my farm over there. And uh, yeah, it just sucks that he didn't give us an ender pearl, doesn't it? Never mind. We can try again in a little while. Let's take this down though, because I don't want anything spawning on top of that. There we go. <laughs> I did get some bones though. Thank God for that. All right, so I finally gave in and made myself one of these watering cans. Um, I need to make the engineer's hammer um from this one uh but at the moment i need to make string which i get like this nice so let's make the i need to i need to go back into here <laughs> so we at least have this so that we can start making our metal plates for our thing over there oh hammer hammer but the reason i'm doing this hemp as well everyone is because i'm so desperate for a bed <laughs> Hey, there we go, everyone. The very first bed ever. Where should we put it? Let's just dump it here for now. I've got nowhere else to put the thing. Oh, man, that makes me so happy having a bed. You've got no idea. All right, so let's see if we can get a little bit further with this stuff. We needed the plastic. So we need the latex processing unit. Oh, man, that's what I'm waiting for. I know I was waiting for something, and it's the iron. Don't know if I'm going to have enough iron for this because we needed like, uh, hang on, what was this thing called again? Oh, no. Where did I miss that then? Oh, it's here. Oh, hang on, what's the other thing? Rubber? <gasps> I have rubber. I don't need to make this. <gasps> oh my God, that is amazing. I can, I can just cook rubber? Sharp. I have a bit of rubber. Look. Oh no, it's resin. <gasps> That's resin. How do I get rubber then? Yeah, I'll do it. Cook resin. Cook, my beauty. Cook. Give me that plastic. Oh, if that's a thing, that is amazing. That means I'll just get them from the rubber trees. Oh, that has completely and utterly changed my, my, my life. Yeah, it has. It's changed my life. That is mental. Let's just cook some of those up. Okay. Right. So the next thing then, we need, we need copper. 
So we need a cutter. Why do we need a cutter for that? That sucks a little bit. Okay, but we need the copper plate. So how many of those do we need? We need six. So let's get six bits of that. We have that with our hammer like this. And then we need to make our cutter. Um, so we need three iron plates and then two. Okay, so no, that was two iron plates, wasn't it? <laughs> two iron plates, was it? Oh no. See, I'm already forgetting the recipe. No, it was three. God love, sort it out, will ya? Okay, like that. And then it was one, two, three. And then the cutters. So I'm assuming that I do it like that. Oh, okay, that makes sense. You get, two, <laughs> you get two out of them. Okay, let's dump you in there. Then next thing we wanted to do was make them into the insulated, which is what I need the rubber for. And I need one more play. Then what about this thing? Oh, wow. Yeah, so we're just waiting on iron, basically, at the moment. That's the, the thing. And obviously the resin. But does this work? Doesn't look like that works. So I need to go and kill some more uh, sp uh, spiders, <laughs> some more skeletons. All right, so if you don't know how to get the sticky resin, I had a look and it looks like you use a tree tap on that thing and it just gets rid of it like that, which looks relatively simple, doesn't it? And I think now I should actually have enough. So let's cook that up. Let's steal some of this. The inventory is looking disgusting as usual. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's get rid of you. Put you in there. Our cobblestone generator is doing beautifully, by the way. I think we have the maximum amount at the moment. So let's put you back in. No, no space. Okay, let's keep you in the, uh, in the inventory then. Okay, so let's grab that. Then I think the recipe was just like that, wasn't it? Oh my God. Oh my God, I can't remember what the machine's called though. Damn it, I need to look at what the machine's called again. Okay, so the machine is called an induction furnace. So let's make our things again. Like that, we have six, yes! Okay, now, oh, oh, hello. Uh, did not see you there, you was a little bit of a surprise. Let's try again. <laughs> oh, wow, that's something, yeah. Okay, we have an electronic circuit. Then we need to make this oh we had that nice okay then okay we need two more redstone and can we oh no we can make the electric we can make the electric furnace we had the electric furnace <laughs> there we need it oh oh wow um okay we need a lot more iron let's grab all of that okay so how much iron do we have we have three how much do we need? One, two, no, that, that's steel. <gasps> that is steel. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, wow, I don't, we don't have steel. How do you make steel? Steel. Oh, I always forget. Isn't it like um, coal and something? Steel boots, no. It's like coal and something. Iron ingot, steel ingot. Oh, in a blast furnace? How do you make a blast furnace? Is that the thing that I've made on Monster Pack? <laughs> I can never remember. Hang on. So we could just do it like that in the blast furnace, which I could quickly Google, couldn't I? All right, everyone. So to make steel, I need to make an induction smelter. For an induction smelter, I need invar, and unfortunately for Invar, I need pulverized iron and nickel, which I need to get a pulverizer for. <laughs> so at the moment, I don't actually have all of this stuff. So I think for today, I'm going to call it there. I am going to somewhere I have gravel. Um, I can't see it though. Where is it? <laughs> this sucks. Where's my gravel gone? Why do I keep losing everything? Where's my gravel? I got gravel from one of my things. I know I did. 
Is it in here? Oh, here it is. Okay, so if we stick gravel on here, then we should have everything ready for next episode to actually finish off our next induction furnace. I really wanted to get that done today, but unfortunately, it's just not possible. There was a lot of obstacles in our way, which was stopping me doing stuff. We had the Enderman. We had two Endermen that stopped me from doing this thing. And now we have the steel production, which I'm getting stopped from doing as well. But we have done a lot of stuff and I'm so happy with the progress that we have got done and made and all that sort of stuff today. So I hope that you've enjoyed today's episode. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and I will see you all next time. Bye. Oh my god, and everyone, on that note, look what I just got! <laughs> I've got an enderpearl next episode, we can actually get our water going! <laughs>